When I was a kid, this used to be my favourite place in the whole world. I think this would still be my favourite spot. That's because you haven't been anywhere. Oh, so where's better than this then? Paris. Plus Dauphine, right by the Pont Neuf. If I shut my eyes now, I know exactly how it feels to be in that little square. Well, so let's go. We could get on the Eurostar right now. You don't get it, Clark. I want to be in Paris as me. The old me. There she goes in front of me. Take my Tell me something good. Use the time he's got left. Show him how good his we'll life can be. We've barely left the house in two years. We have tried. Yes, but we haven't succeeded. Will needs to be allowed to feel like a man. Can I take you somewhere? You are so going on a date with Will Trainer. It's too baby. Get the red dress out. We'll make a memory out of it. Lose the scarf. If you're going to wear a dress like that, Clark, you have to wear it with confidence. Only you, Will Trainer, would tell a woman how to wear a bloody dress. Move closer. <laughs> you smell fantastic. <laughs> You know you never would have let those breasts so near to me if I was in a wheelchair. <laughs> yeah, well, you never would have been looking at these breasts if you hadn't been in a wheelchair. Well, what? Of course I would. No, you wouldn't. You wouldn't. You would have been too busy looking at the leggy blondes, the ones you can smell an expense account at 40 <laughs> bases. And anyway, I would have been over there serving the drinks. One of the invisibles. Am I right? Yes, but in my defense, <laughs> <laughs> I was an arse. <laughs> yep. <laughs> You know something, Clark? You are pretty much the only thing that makes me want to get up in the morning. And let's go somewhere. Anywhere in the world, just you and me. What do you say? Say yes, Will. Go on. Okay. It's gotta get easier and easier somehow. I can't. You can. You can do anything. to miss all the things that someone else could give you. I have become a whole new person because of you. Will, can I ask you something? What happened? Sorry. Stay. Tell me something good. Happy. You are pretty much the only thing that makes me want to get up in the morning. Me Before You, rated PG-13. Hey, it's Lisa here. Now, staying with the drama genre, 2016 is going to be a great year for dramas. And here are some you can't miss. First up, Me Before You. Now, this is about a young woman who finds romance where she least expects it. And it's based on the critically acclaimed best-selling novel by Jojo Moyers. Me Before You stars Game of Thrones Amelia Clarke and Sam Claflin from the Hunger Games series and is under the direction of Thea Sharrock, making her feature film directorial debut. This upcoming drama romance hits theatres on June 3. Next up, Free the State of Jones, written and directed by four-time Oscar nominee Gary Ross and starring Oscar winner Matthew McConaughey. Free State of Jones is an epic action drama set during the Civil War and tells the story of defiant Southern farmer Newt Knight and his extraordinary armed rebellion against the Confederacy. This upcoming drama action movie will open in theatres May 13. Now I've got Money Monster and 12 years after they last worked together in Ocean's 12, Julia Roberts and George Clooney reunite once again in the upcoming Money Monster. Directed by Jodie Foster, this drama thriller is about Lee Gates, a TV personality whose insider trading tips have made him the money guru of Wall Street. When Kyle, a viewer who lost all his family's money on a bad tip from Lee, holds Lee hostage on air, rating saw as the entire country tunes into this media frenzy to find out just how much a man's life is worth. Money Monster is set for release on May 13. 
Okay, so there you have it. Let me know in the comments below your thoughts on these movies and I'll leave you with our drama movie playlist so you can watch all the trailers. See you next time.